Hello Sagittarius. This is your reading for the 28th through the 29th. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Thank you guys for coming to check me out. Let's see what we've got for you guys in love, for Sagittarius in love for the 28th through the 29th. Please show me. Ooh, the tower. Something has ended abruptly here. Hmm. I feel that um, maybe it's just affecting you or either maybe a Scorpio or an, or an Aries individual. But I feel like there's one person that's really shook here. Six of Pentacles. Maybe somebody just found out that the other person um, does not want to be um, in a connection anymore. Does not want to work on a connection and give you know, the other one what it is that they feel like they really need. Here. This is North Node and South Node too. Scorpio and Taurus energy here. Hmm. What else do we have here? And the moon. There's something that hasn't been revealed here though. There's something that I feel that um Somebody's holding back. Somebody's holding in. And I'm feeling like it's their emotions. It's their feelings. It's the way they truly feel. I feel like there are some secrets here that are itching to come out, honestly. Let's see. The King of Swords there. Aquarius, Libra, Sagittarius, energy. What did I say? Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, energy here. It's early, guys. But definitely somebody wants, somebody wants to speak on how they really feel. And this is regarding a situation where you guys probably felt devastated because you expected more out of this individual and it just really shocked you that things went south. I'm definitely getting that somebody wants to talk. Somebody wants to work things out here. Somebody wants to let you guys know how they really feel. Please show me more about the tower here. The four of wands, yes, a relationship. Maybe even a marriage ended here. Hmm. A home that was happy once upon a time. A family. Please show me more about the six of pentacles. The Seven of Wands. Yeah, somebody has been very defensive, very selfish, I feel, in this connection, okay? Um, they they may have been given to someone else or another situation even. Um, maybe they had an extended family even that they were, you know, lending more of their energy to. Maybe an ex-wife or husband and children, um, possibly. And um, they weren't all in the way that you guys needed them to be or vice versa but whoever was shook I feel like at this point it's like you know I'm not allowing anything to affect you know what I have going on right now my stability okay I'm not taking anything less than what I deserve I'm not allowing any bullshit please show me more about the moon the high priestess yeah definitely a lot of things that were hidden here and it's so 
um, it speaks volumes with the with the high priestess coming under the moon because all both of these are all about feelings that have not been spoken spoken a lot of I feel like um, communication unspoken communication between you and someone else I feel like both of you guys feel it I feel like maybe you guys have been communicating through your dreams if you've been dream dreaming about this individual a lot then nine times out of ten they've been dreaming about you too you guys are communicating okay that energy is shared is is, is felt Please show me more about the King of Swords. The Ace of Wands. This King of Swords wants to start over. They're very attracted to you. They want to reveal something to you guys. This person may have had a mistress or a mister on the side. May have had another family or an ex with children even that they weren't over yet while you guys were together here okay let's see what other energy is coming in for Sagittarius what energy is coming in for Sagittarius the fool I feel you guys saying uh no been there done that <laughs> I am on to something else, but I'm feeling like this person definitely wants to take a leap of faith with you. I think you feel like it would be foolish. Okay, what else? The Ten of Swords. Yeah, it's too much of a headache. Too much of a headache. And it's like, you, you're not wanting to deal with that anymore. You're over people playing mind games and things like that, okay? Why is this happening? Why is this happening? <laughs> yeah you've changed you've changed so have they though you've changed mm -mm. I don't see you looking back I see you only want to move forward oh wow okay yeah you only want to move forward when then we have the four of pentacles in the reverse here yeah you've let go you've let go and then we have the ten of cups you've let go it's like you know what I'm on to something else. Something that's really going to make me happy. I'm not with playing games. I'm not with mind games. That's over with. You're no longer holding on to whatever happened here either. Now, you won't forget it because it's like you need that as a reminder of what not to allow again. So we have Pisces, Capricorn, Gemini, Scorpio, Aries, um, I feel Cancers here. Again, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus. Energy is here as well. Alright guys, so that's what I have for you guys. And I will be speaking with you soon.